Hi, this is Renee of Setting Upside Down in Blueberry here. Somebody thought I was boring. That's fine. So I'm going to give you a little tour of the van. I don't know if it's worth seeing, but hold on. So here is the place where I put the food. I mentioned it before. It's just a bag within a bag. It's mostly soups right now. So there's that. I cover it up. Keep it cool in. These papers were what was on the windows before I started using the curtains. And now what I do is I push them up near the door to try to keep the cracks closed. Doesn't work that great. But since it's darker in here, I don't think it really matters that much. If they look in, they're just going to see dark. There's a pillow I've been pushing under there and then covering it with this in the daylight. It's my sweater. This thing I had on a minute ago called a scarf. I'm walking on the carpet. Okay, I'm falling over the carpet, looks like. This is where the, uh, behind the seat, where the laptop is and my clothes hamper. We've seen that before. In the daylight, I've been putting these up like this. I, I have to be able to see out of my windows right now. I'm not multi-talented like everyone else that just uses mirrors. I have to practice to do that. Okay. Here's my two empty jugs. I just emptied one yesterday. I moved the one that has water in it closer to the front. This is the, the, bat, uh, the storage I got for 150 I got two of these. You saw one a few minutes ago. This is the one that has the Magic Mattress Pad in it. Okay, I used this last night. Remember I said I was going to use it to see if I could get more warmth right here where I'm laying between these seats. I laid it across there. It was pretty awesome. Kept my buns warm. It did a good job for that. I think I like that for now. I've been using this extra rug to fill in the gaps that happen when I put up my curtain at night. I'll show you that in a second. This is the back seat. Extra paper from when I was using uh, this on the back window. Now I have this here, the rounded one.